Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to resolve if your mouse cursor is moving in the opposite direction on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here guys, and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. First thing I recommend doing, if you're using a wireless mouse, that means you have batteries in it, I recommend changing the batteries and seeing if that increases the responsiveness or sensitivity of your computer mouse. If that does not achieve the desired result, something else we can try here as well, if we would open up the search menu, type in control panel, best match, or come back with control panel, go ahead and open that up. Set your view by in the top right to large icons, and then you want to go down and select the mouse. Select the pointer options button, check mark where it says display pointer trails, and uncheck where it says hide the pointer while typing, and then see if that helps resolve the issue. You can also adjust the sensitivity or visibility of the pointer trails from long to short. So it's just something else you can take a look into here as well. Default settings are normally to have this unchecked, so do not display pointer trails as well as hide pointer while typing. That's typically the default option. I just want to point that out there. And then something else we can try as well, if you're still having issues maybe that aren't even related to the computer mouse, just might be more issues with your Windows computer acting very slowly. You may have a lot of programs installed, or you may want to upgrade your hardware. It just might be a little delay in the mouse as a consequence of that. I would suggest running a system file checker as well as a DISM command as well, just to kind of clean up possible miscellaneous system issues that could be contributing to a lag in your mouse responsiveness. So in order to, to do that, open up the search menu, type in CMD, best match, or come back with command prompt. Go ahead and right click on that and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, go ahead and select yes. Now the first command I'm going to have in the description of my video is a DISM command. So go ahead and copy that and then go up to the top bar of the command prompt window here. Right click on it, select edit and paste that in. Hit enter to begin the scan. Just give it a moment here. Okay, so once that one is done, go ahead and copy the second command in the description of the video. It's the System File Tracker Utility. It starts with SFC, and then go to the top bar of the command prompt and paste it in the same way you did the first one, and hit Enter.
Okay, so you can see Windows Resource Protection did find corrupt files and successfully repair them. Go ahead and close out of here and restart your device. And there you go, guys. Hopefully that point or issue has been resolved with your computer or mouse, and you should be good to go. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.